The foundation of Third Army's readiness is built on highly motivated NCOs. So in a way, Third Army builds its future by conducting its own warrior leader course. The course is designed the same as all other WLCs throughout the Army, with one big difference. We have instructors from all different academies. We have them from all three uh, components. We've got from active, National Guard, and reserve. So we've had uh, instructors from all over the world that are brought here. We put them together and formed this uh, mobile training team. These small group leaders, or SGLs, took on the challenge of coming together quickly to give these students realistic training. These are some of the most professional NCOs I've ever had the pleasure of working with. Uh, it, we came together easily. It, it, we had about two weeks to put the academy together from the ground up, and it, it worked very smoothly. The students say they appreciate the SGL's guidance. They, they set the example. Uh, they show us what right is. Um, some may have a, a different perspective coming from uh, National Guard uh, and uh, regular Army, but I think overall they, uh, they set a great example of show us how to be better leaders. We all have the same standard because WLC is a standard across the board. Uh, coming from my academy at Fort Sill, Oklahoma, coming here, I think definitely I've learned from the other SGLs that just their method to accomplishing our task. And they've got some great tricks of the trade. They've got some great uh, methods to uh, evaluate the soldiers, pay attention to the soldiers, um, and train the soldiers to give them information. Specialist Branson Dillon, Camp Buren, Kuwait. That's the Army Today from Soldiers Radio and Television.